To start the day off, I'm gonna have watermelon. I typically have about four pounds of watermelon every morning. I had a little bit of watermelon left over in the fridge, so I'm gonna have that container of watermelon as well as another half of watermelon. I really like starting my morning off with really hydrating fruits, and watermelons are best eaten alone, all by themselves with no other fruit with them, just because watermelons digest really quickly, so in order to avoid bloating or like any digestive discomfort or anything like that, I like to eat them all by themselves. One thing about watermelons though is that they aren't very calorie dense, so it's a lot of water content whenever you eat watermelons, so you might not be able to last as long whenever you eat them, so you might have to have a snack a couple of hours later to hold you over until lunch. For lunch, I had six large oranges. I like to have mono meals where I'm basically sitting down and I'm eating one type of fruit in one sitting and I like to eat that fruit until I feel comfortably full and satiated. As a snack before my workout, I'm having about two cups of sweet green grapes. I typically work out around three o'clock so I like to eat something about 20 minutes before that just to give me that energy to get me through my workout. Today is back and biceps day and to start my workout I am doing three sets of pull-ups. And for my pull-ups, I like to do about 8 to 12 reps per set. After that, I'm moving on to a seated cable row. For this one, I also do three sets in the 8 to 12 rep range. I like to have a slight lean forward just to focus on my lats a little bit more because when you put that extra emphasis on your lat muscles, it helps to give you that illusion of an hourglass figure. So when you do back exercises and leg exercises, you're helping to create that illusion of an optically smaller waist. That's one of the reasons why I love weightlifting because it really gives you the power and the control to shape and define your body in the way that you want to. Next up, I'm doing a cable lat pullover. I'm also doing three sets of eight to 12 reps. Again, this exercise is helping to focus on the lat muscles. I don't have access to many machines, so I have to use a cable for a lot of my exercises. Now we're moving on to the bicep portion of the workout. I am doing an incline dumbbell curl. And this is actually one of my favorite bicep exercises. I don't know why. I think I just enjoy the fact that I can sit down while I do it. And I like to do this exercise for three sets in the eight to 12 rep range. Then I'm gonna finish off the workout with a preacher curl. I am doing three sets of eight to 12 reps. After my workout, I had dinner, and for dinner, I had a huge leafy green salad. In this salad, I had baby spring mix, I had shredded carrot, radishes, onions, tomatoes, and cucumber. I also used a cashew cream dressing over the salad. Overall, this salad was about two and a half pounds. So even though this salad was a lot of bulk and it did make me feel full, it didn't give me enough calories. So a couple of hours later, I had about eight mangoes with three bananas and a drizzle of date syrup. If you liked this video, make sure that you click the video on the screen. This is another video that I think you'll like, and I'll see you there.